drip email marketing tutorial step by step. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily use Dream for our email campaigns. Basically it's not that hard so here we are on drip.com and we have a true trial so we can easily click on try drip for free to create an account. And after a small registration, we'll come to our dashboard from this page here. We can easily interact with all the features for free. As you can see, we have like 40 days trial and all the power is at your fingertips with the only limit 500 emails and so we can easily try get uh, like trip.com for free and after that we can decide is it necessary as for us to buy their paid plan so here we are on our dashboard and as you can see in the left side we have a menu with people campaigns workflows and analytics on the people area we can find all the uh, contacts we have so we can easily go to save segments to find all the segments we have we can easily create a new or we can like interact with an existing on the dashboard on people folder we can easily find all these statistics as you can see like total people new subscribers first time purchase and so on and so basically to interact with a uh, our people list you just simply need to click on plus and create so as you can see we have like some options here import list of people we can create new segment new on-site campaign or new email campaign basically to create like a uh, uh, new uh, contacts on this website we just simply need to click on import new people and we can easily uh, import them with like four steps so we can like use a plot list of people we can use mailchimp import into a list of emails or add a single person so it depends on your like uh, style if you have uh, the list in your mailchimp like service you can easily integrate it to uh, drip.com we can also like upload a file or enter a list of emails so it depends on our purposes and so on so this is a way of how can we interact with our subscribers on drip on the campaigns folder we can easily find like on-site single emails email series email templates text email templates and some other stuff so in order to interact we just simply need to uh, find the folder which is suitable as for us and from this page here we can easily manage all the existing campaigns or we can create a new like in this case single email campaign also on the workflow we can find all the workflows we have also we can create and do some other stuff and on the analytic folder we can find all the metrics for example for email metrics for our revenue and so on to improve the workflow to improve all the uh, parts of the huge system so it's pretty cool to analyze all the data so we'll come to our uh, campaigns and we'll try to create new uh, we will follow from this tab. So firstly, we need to choose from Visual Builder or Text HTML Builder. Let's try to use Visual Builder. Builder. Uh, basically, we need to name our campaign. Let it be like C1 Campaign 1. Uh, create campaign. And we'll come to the next tab from this page here. We just simply need to uh, add it like sending to. We need to add... Um, the segment we are going to send our campaign to so basically before creating we just need to import our uh, contacts on the email design we can easily find a lot of different templates we can easily use so here we are it depends on your like uh, purposes but let's try to find something which is suitable as for me for example this one here so we can just simply click and then just use this template and as you can see it looks like this uh, we can simply click on edit to go to uh, the builder to editor from this page here we can easily interact with every single uh, element for example with this part here we just simply need to click on edit and as you can see we can easily add the content here content here we can uh, manage this logo so all the properties are displayed in the left uh, part of the screen so as you can see uh, the image is right up here like link alt text alignment for the photos we have like properties like this if you're going to interact with uh, for example um, with this part here with uh, like the main page 
uh, we can easily click on text for example and if you'll we'll highlight it we can easily change the properties we can make it bold italic underline and so on change the font font size change some other stuff change the alignment so basically this uh, editor is pretty easy to understand maybe it's not that like interface friendly as for me it's a little bit hard to find all the things but um, it, it's it's like in a few maybe you need just practice to understand everything right up here so we'll, we can easily click on save and our email design will be successfully like saved but also of course uh, you need to customize it as for your purposes and also we can split test variations so it's like a b testing or something like this uh, while not required to send this email a split test can help you optimize your content to drive up both engagement and results so we can easily change the subject line as you can see uh, or we can like change the email content so increase your open rates and increase your conversion rate so it depends on the things we are going to add so in order to get the variation we just simply need to click on add variation and then just uh, manage all this stuff so as you can see we have like two variations and we can uh, manage them from page here and then everything is done we can just simply click on send on schedule in the right bottom corner here and um, we can easily send this mail even on the free plan so it's pretty cool when everything is done we'll find our campaign on this folder with like drafts or send so basically as you can see we can manage all the opens find the analytics about clicks custom conversions and so on and if you're going to discover the paid plan we can easily find that price depends on the number of people we are going to interact with so um, the lowest price is like $39 per month it's like for 2500 people and if you'll we'll have like 10 million we'll have to chat or we have like two uh, one like uh, hundred and fifty thousand uh, people the price is like one thousand and six ninety nine so basically the prices are different and as for me it's pretty cool that we have the option to try it for free and after that we can easily decide is it necessary as for us to buy a paid plan so this is that's it basically for a drip i hope guys uh, this video helped you out if you have any questions you can of course write them in the comments below maybe about like our uh, contents import like campaign creating or something like this of course please write your questions i'll try to answer for all of them basically that's all for this video i hope guys uh, it made life a little bit easier uh, please leave a like comment and subscribe i wish you a very good day goodbye